well now. Here's Shinri Shiora. He had a 48 uh, 68 in the qualifiers. And already a gold medalist, Nakamura, 48-56. So Japan will be flanking the whole team. They've got one and eight, lanes one and eight. Nakamura in lane one. Brazil's Marcelo Chierigini. He's 48-44. In fact, they're all within 48 mark. Here's Jack Cartwright. 48-43 for him. It's Kyle Chambers as well, also for Australia. But uh, the other Brazilian is Pedro Spajari. Kyle Chalmers, 48-23, is the next to go. Uh, he's the real deal, isn't he? Absolutely superb. Caleb Dressel. He's a multi, multi gold medalist and has been certainly for several years and has been right at the top. Zachary Apple is right there as well. He's the top scorer in the qualifiers, 48.03. Caleb Dressel at 48.13 are the likely lads right in the middle there in uh, four and five as ever. In the finals, the highest qualifiers will be attempting from the center to uh, impress us. World Championships, uh, Dressel, he's got gold in so many different areas. The 100 meter freestyle at a 47.17, 217 championships. Apple has been very, very impressive, I have to say. Really good. He flew onto the scene. An extraordinary style. And, uh, well, he didn't start swimming year round until he was 16. He was playing other sports like basketball and he was on the athletics track as well. But uh, a really, really impressive emergence of. The Apple boy, Zachary Apple. He is going to be the big, big favorite for this, I would imagine. Carl Chalm uh, Chalmers as well is absolutely there with a big, big chance. Will we see Brazil medal for the first time in these championships? Pedro Svajari is also in with a chance. Two lengths of the ball. Who's first to break? I got a feeling it was Dressel. This is a really, really impressive start by Zachary Apple. Just look at him. He's absolutely flying at the moment. Over in uh, lane one, though, Nakamura is doing very well. It's a really tight battle, all four of them in a line. And look at uh, the Brazilian, Cheringuini. But Apple, my goodness me, this is really, really tight. Jack Cartwright is also showing right there. They're in a line. Jack Cartwright is doing a brilliant job here. Jack Cartwright, Carl Chambers. Carl Chambers is coming through. Carl Chambers from Cartwright, and that is an excellent work from Chuck, uh, Chalmers. Cartwright, Australia one and two. That is a huge surprise. And I have to say, a brilliant, brilliant performance. 48 dead. Wow. That is better than anything in qualifiers. And just that, look at that. Jack Cartwright, one and two from lane three and two. Kyle Chalmers, Jack Cartwright, Australia, one and two. What a great performance there. And well done to Zach Apple. He went away so, so fast. 
at the start. But this was fantastic resilience from Carl Chalmers. Wow. Didn't really feature him, did I, earlier? But that is so, so impressive. Brilliant work there from the Aussie. Holds the junior world record in a 100 meters freestyle. Won the gold medal in that event in 2016 Summer Olympics. So Chalmers delivers again. The big tuner, they call him. Well, he certainly is uh, a fantastic athlete, isn't he? Look at that. Australia, what a start they've had. Carl Chambers, uh, Chalmers, I beg his pardon, Jack Cartwright, Caleb Dressel. Didn't even mention him until right at the end. But isn't that funny how Zachary Apple fell away down that final 